Okay guys, here's one of the cheapest travel trailers on the market. It's a brand new 2023 Coleman Model 17B, listed just under 16,000. Let's go inside, one step up, and as soon as you come in, you have your dinette area with a removable table here. It's not anchored down to the floor, which I like for flexibility and versatility. This would be used as your eating area, your workspace, uh, or you can remove that dinette table and make this a separate sleeping quarters. Okay, This does have bunk beds for children or guests directly behind your dinette, and it does have a master bedroom in like an open studio apartment setting right here. Um, now, with regards to the dinette, you do have a slide-out window for good airflow. You do have storage above with light brown uh, modern decor which I like these cabinets it doesn't feel like an old travel trailer very new and modern and again you have that nice decor behind your master bedroom I like that you have a little area to put your phone or laptop and charge to the 120 outlet while you sleep I also like the window air conditioner why because it's easy to replace you just go to Walmart and do it yourself versus a rooftop AC where you'd probably have to get a mobile tech to do that if you weren't too handy. Um, so, you know, the only thing with a window AC is that, you know, depending on if your travel trailer's level or, level or not, you gotta be careful that water doesn't run back in your unit, you know, that it runs outside the vented area. But, you know, that should keep you pre plenty cool within this space again that's your master bedroom LED puck lighting and you do have a cable outlet there where you can mount a TV here a swivel so you can use it for your bed or your dinette area okay and now we're gonna go into the kitchen now the kitchen is very nice okay everything you need a sink a white sink with some modern uh, like Famica but still nice countertop two burner propane gas stove a window but this window does not ventilate okay it's just for sunlight and cabinetry above to store your canned goods etc now what I love about underneath the sink is you have an electric fireplace okay that's very nice for heating and for visual aesthetics right next to your dinette so you can work or eat here and if it's a cooler night hit your electric fireplace for warmth and cosmetic looks and you got your airflow you got everything you would need in a small camper, one of the cheapest on the market. Uh, these are mainly uh, known for at Camping World, okay? Now, here is, well, let's finish your kitchen. Now, your kitchen has a built-in microwave, okay? And a dorm size refrigerator. It seems a little bit bigger because it's elevated. It's in like this little cove, but it's just a dorm style. So sometimes that's negative where you know you can't fit gallons of water and bigger bulk items right but you can remove some of these shelves and maybe get a gallon of water in there or some bigger items and there is a little freezer compartment uh, but you could still live out of here as one person or two and certainly if you just have guests you know you don't need a lot okay but if you were living out of this the smaller refrigerator is a little bit of a negative so just something to think about okay and directly off your kitchen is your bunk beds. What I like about the bunk bed on the bottom is you do have a window that pops out for airflow. It's also an emergency egress. You do have puck lighting. And the unit up top, no window, okay? But it's another space to accommodate uh, someone for sleeping, a child or a guest or whoever. And if not, you can just use it as storage. And you do have a vent there above. Now let's go into the bathroom. Again, you got nice uh, furnishings, nice decor here. Here is uh, a, a plenty big enough bathroom, okay? You have your toilet, obviously, right? You can hang some things. You can put a mirror there. And this is your uh, shower, which I like. It's just one step up. If you were senior, disabled, or heavy, it's not that hard to get in and out, okay? That's what you look for, okay? Um, and, you know, it's got your shower head, basic plastic one, but you can certainly replace that and upgrade. But it's basic and functional, along with a, a vent up top. Your shower, okay, with your curtain. Everything you would need. You have beautiful laminate flooring throughout. This travel trailer here is a bang for your buck. Brand new, 
Uh, you get it towed to a campsite that you may stay at annually, or you tow it yourself uh, under 5,000 pounds. Uh, so many uh, SUVs can tow this. You can check out the weight specs online to get the specifics, but I believe it's between three to 4,000 pounds dry weight. But very functional, okay? Very simple, but also has all the amenities you need, uh, some extra luxuries, that fireplace, and different things. Let's take a final look outside. I would buy this. I would give this a thumbs up if it fits your lifestyle, okay? <clears throat> You have a little propane gas outlet there on the bottom. You have your two leveling or stabilizing jacks, I should say. Excuse me, they just have a bunch of stuff surrounding this. But, you know, it's a basic outside. It doesn't look that inspiring. The decor is simple. The I wish they would have put a little bit more effort into the color of the outside and the, you know, the cosmetic look. Uh, it would have really made a big difference just a little more effort and there's the window AC exhaust But for under 16,000, you know, what can you expect? Well, you can expect this brand new travel trailer with a three-year structural warranty to give you everything you need for yourself Your family to live or camp out of click the thumbs up share the video. See you in the next one